It's Wednesday, October 17th, 2007. I'm James Kotecki, and this is Playbook TV. Our top story, the Iowa Republican Party announced that it's planning to hold its first in the nation caucus on January 3rd, 2008, giving Iowa Republicans just enough time to get over their New Year's Eve celebrations before casting their vote. According to the Des Moines Register, Iowa Democrats are sticking with the January 14th caucus, at least for now. The Politico's Roger Simon reports that New Hampshire Secretary of State Bill Gardner might move his state's primary up to December. These primaries and caucuses are really starting to intrude in the holiday season, but what can anybody do about it? Well, Ernest saved Christmas once, but God have mercy on us all if we need to call upon him once again. Continuing with our holiday theme, we move on to some juicy turkey talk from the Politico's Patrick O'Connor. A symbolic resolution designating the World War I era killing of ethnic Armenians as genocide passed the House Foreign Affairs Committee last week, but support for the measure is waning because the Bush administration and the Turkish government have warned that its passage could seriously damage ties between the U.S. and Turkey, a critical ally in the Iraq War and the successor to the Ottoman government that executed the killings. Top House Democrats have urged Speaker Pelosi not to bring the bill to the floor, and several members have withdrawn support for the legislation. A House Democratic leadership aide says that despite all this, the Speaker and the Majority Leader are still committed to bringing the House bill to the floor for a vote. Finally, Bloomberg reports Hillary Clinton raised more money from Wall Street in the third quarter than Barack Obama, Rudy Giuliani, and Mitt Romney combined. She raised almost $750,000 from top Wall Street firms. Those other guys didn't even get close to $200,000. Why is this important? Because Wall Street donors don't get weighed down by such obscurities as issues or values or beliefs. Their biggest concern? Betting on a winner. A new CNN poll shows Clinton with a 30-point lead over Barack Obama. She's now at 51%. Did I mention that's out of eight Democrats in the field? Well, that's it for today's hit. Be sure to check out politico.com slash playbook for more stories, including the latest on the nomination of Michael McCasey to be the next attorney general. And don't worry, because even if Ernest can't save Christmas, I've got Clarence the Angel on speed dial. Right here on Playbook TV.